for downloading books is Z Library. They have a website, but I already have the app on my phone. This is the Android version. I don't know if it's available for iOS as iPhone, I guess. And you just get on there, type the book you want. There are different ways you can go about it. You can see some of the searches I've made myself for books I want. I've been using it for, I think, two years now. But the app just since last year. I never realized they had an app until I stumbled upon it one time. So now I'm looking for under the dollar trees we actually forgotten the name of the author at this point in time so oh she needs a parata that's out i read it before i'm just hunting it down for a friend who asked for it so oftentimes they come in different formats the basic format is the one that was uploaded in and sometimes the basic format might be epub and then they show you pdf or movie or any other one and you can take that but i think there's a risk of the fact that it may not come out the way it's supposed to be so if you have the option and download this one now so i don't sound it for it again but usually when you check it out epo mobile or so the one that if you wanted the pdf version and you saw a pdf version instead of converting it down here in the epo just go and take it where it is the basic format already so you don't have to convert anything and for the other ways of searching, this is here. If you know the here, it was made, you know the language. For this, you can choose which extension you want it to come out. And these are one, two, three, four, five. So these are 11 different ways or different extensions you can use. Alternatively, you can use the auto. You know, parental. Okay, and but for this you see all of the happiness like water under the dollar trees and um, just like that. Then you just look for what you are looking for for them. Yes, it does not have all the books in the world, but it's an amazing tool and I love using it because it allows you to get a lot of books. Then which other thing is there for you to remember while using this? Yes, it is free. But it has a limit to an extent. You can, as you can see, it's showing a downloaded seven over ten. What it really, sh what that means is that I can download a max of ten books per day with this, which is actually a lot. I don't really think you need ten books per day most times. Um, so that is a lot. And you, you have. I think if you've not registered, you can only download about five books per day. You can see it here. So for the basic, you can download 10 books per day, you cannot get sent to Kindle features, you cannot convert files or one click download or a few that is what is. Uh, that is actually very wonderful, for, it's not really a limitation. Because here yeah, the premium is saying up to 999 and I don't think I only 999 books in one day. Download speed up to YMB for a second, which is not so bad. You still have download history, you can send books to mails here. I can choose a book here and send it to someone, send this to Google Drive, Telegram as a personal recommendation. So it's really wonderful here. If you to increase your limits, you can just um, you know, make a donation with a Visa, MasterCard, VTC, whatever. A donation of $1 to uh, $5, $4.99 will grant you access to all features without extending your download limit during the next 13 days. But if you donate to above five dollars to basically ten dollars because nine point nine nine, you will improve limits to fifteen downloads per day during the next thirteen days, and it goes like that, like that, until you get up to donation of hundred dollars or more, which will improve your limit to nine hundred and ninety nine downloads per day during the next nine hundred and ninety nine. This so it's a very wonderful tool, and I recommend it constantly and consistently. And there's a way to get books. This there's also PDF drive and a host of others, but this is my go to space ever since any books is hired. So, like I say, break up with me, break my heart, pack up, and walk away. I use them extensively, and um, I do miss them, but well, like they say, we've got to move on. So, have a great day. Once again, this is the doctor of writing. With an unsolicited recording, just guiding you through how I get my own books and how you can too. Take care.